What's up guys? Shoe here. Back again today. I uh, just got a quick little video up. Hopefully it won't be 14 minutes. I don't know. Um, you guys know I posted on Instagram. Um, I got my Grateful Dead set in the mail. Which uh, some of you guys may or may not have known. Um, Grateful Dead's one of my favorite bands of all time. That and ACDC and uh, you know a few other random ones. <clears throat> but uh went pretty reckless without a doubt but uh all them new bands they don't hold any water to the grateful dead so this is a video just to show you these guys and they're not in any sequential order i guess really well kind of start with this one here's the card art dancing bears this is the dream van although they call it uh what do they call it dream van it's a panel because they took all the windows out of it and it's got you know bears on the roof one sunroof on there not a huge fan of the dream van um obviously i like this one and i love the wheels you guys know those are archie van wheels so pff, awesome totally awesome grateful dead on the back i've been waiting for this joker um down here there's so many scalpers so i went ahead and popped for the set on uh on ebay 42 bucks seven dollars a hit eh, a little pricey figure they're gonna be 5.99 at walmart or or at uh, Toys R Us or any of those. So I only paid a dollar more, you know, like, so you figure you chalk in the dollar for the convenience charge of getting them before everybody else and guaranteed to get a set, eh, it's worth it to me. So sometimes, you know what I mean? And I, you know, I bought them from wheelcollectors.com. They're a pretty reputable set of guys, I guess. Overland Park, Kansas is where they're out of. And uh, here's the back. I'll show you the back real quick. You can pause it. They renamed uh, the Rescue Ranger, the Grateful Dead truck. I don't know what that's about, you know what I mean? And obviously the dairy and the, uh, you know, the Type 1 panel are, are going to be the impossible ones to get out of here. And, of course, followed by the uh, tra the uh, drag truck. So this one will probably be the one of the ones you'll be able to find on the pegs, more than likely. Maybe not, though. There are a lot of deadheads out there. There's people that, that listen to the Grateful Dead that even if they don't, collect hot wheels if they see these they're gonna grab them you know i mean kind of like the star trek flintstone situation where you know like somebody walking by the peg sees a flintstone or a star trek even if they don't collect hot wheels they're gonna be like "Ooh, that's cool and grab it you know what i mean so that's what these are gonna be so not only here's the one from terrapin station the uh baja beetle so even if you know you're not a hot wheels collector but you are a rock memorabilia or, you know, or Grateful Dead. If you're a deadhead, for sure, these are, they're not going to last. <clears throat> uh, here's a Steal Your Face, uh, the Rescue Ranger. They call it the Grateful Dead uh, truck, but obviously it's a Rescue Ranger. They did really good. Look at the red and the chrome in the bed. And believe it or not, look, painted headlights and, uh, you know, marker lights. They did a really good job on these. That thing is supreme beast. I collect Rescue Rangers, believe it or not. I collect everything. It, let's be real. It's Hot Wheels. But I have quite a few Rescue Rangers and uh, and bugs and all kinds of stuff. So, to me, this set was beyond appealing. You know what I mean? On top of the fact that it's one of my favorite bands. If I don't listen to the Grateful Dead every day, I, I probably would go um, crazy. You know, honestly, they, they're pretty... They're, you don't listen to the Grateful Dead, and you want a nice mellow, some nice mellow music, and uh, you know what I mean. They don't have, they have a lot of songs, but they all pretty much blend together. You, I, I probably could sit here and sing them all to you. You know what I mean? Relatively easy. Um, here's the other one. This is uh, the the uh, drag truck. That thing is awesome. Totally awesome. Painted tail lights. You know, of course, these are all going to be really detailed up. Um, not a whole lot on, on this one as far as the art goes. Um, what is this? Blues for Allah? Or uh, Bertha? It's one of the two. Um, I guess this one's Bertha. This is the uh, this is the Dairy Delivery. That one's going to be an impossible one to get. And it, they did really good on them, man. They look really, really good. And it's got like a uh, tan, believe it or not, a tan line on the wheel. To match it that thing's just cool and it's just got a couple of you know little like wood details on the roof so that thing's pretty awesome and the card the card art is absolutely unreal these are going to get a special place uh, you know what i mean and I, you know the cards are dead mint on them you know what i mean like 
none of these cards are in bad shape so i'm gonna have to figure a way that i can display them all you know just the six together because i, I have some other grateful dead memorabilia and random stuff and uh so the last one is the um t1 panel which you know this was the wolfman and a few of the other ones but that thing's really cool and now you, you can't see it probably on my camera you can catch it see the overlay white on top of the gold on either side of the steel your face which of course if you don't know anything about the dead that symbol is called steal your face ironically enough pretty funny um, but the little white uh, hologram uh, people around the entire bus I think they, do they go on the back okay they don't go on the back although the lights are detailed in I'm um, down the side is um, dancing bears across the whole thing you can just barely make them out and of course the glare on my phone is going to give you a hard time but man this set is absolutely gorgeous there's the roof you know like some cool flame scalp kind of a gig so i ordered the, this set because you know number one you know you guys know i love them but uh that way i guarantee to get a set because um the tampa bay area has uh, a little over three million people live in here so there's quite a few collectors so you know I you guys know I get skunked at the pegs a lot or I find regs like uh, you know I found a case of K today and everything good was gone I mean I got lots of uh, other stuff you know what I mean I got a few of these because I love that truck in red and you know I found some more vans um, you know I got a couple of f-150s and and some other stuff like that but uh, you know just mostly filler stuff you know what i mean i i obviously i didn't find any supers or even any regs um so for me i you know i had to i had to pull the punch on these you know what i mean and i would have anyway so but now um you know if you want to get this set i promise you you're going to have to case raid to get them so all you guys that don't case raid better start carrying a pocket knife with you because you're going to need it to get these they're, they're going to be hard to hard to get so, you know like i said you'll probably score the dream van and if you get lucky you might find the baja bug but unless you jump on the others good luck to you and now uh there's a new sidekick out at walmart and you guys know i collect my disney uh cars and they come out with a new set of planes okay i don't collect a lot of the planes because they take up a lot of space <clears throat> you know what i mean I'm a Disney Cars guy. I saw the movie Planes with my niece. I took her to the movie theater to see it or whatnot. But uh, this set that came out, this is called Planes Fire Rescue. This is the first one I'm going to show you. Blackout. And here's the back. There's Drip and uh, Avalanche and Mayday, which I, I got. I'm going to show you. I've got these because they're vehicles. They're construction vehicles, and they're Disney, and, you know, yeah, they're attached to planes, but technically they're still cars, you know what I mean? They're all related, so to speak. So um, I didn't get all of them tonight because, believe it or not, they're $5.80 a hit, you know, which is pricey, and, you know, I was hunting on a budget again tonight. Even though I got paid yesterday, you guys saw what I spent all my money on Black Bandits, and... Uh, and that that set that came in the mail so i got these three today i'll probably go back there's uh let's see if the other one shows it no it doesn't show it there's a little blue guy that's like a forklift and there's uh you know the another one of these little guys that's got a bucket i got three of them today so i'm gonna go ahead and rip them for you i'm already at eight and a half minutes you guys know i rip them all out anyways this one's called blackout and on the back it, it tells about little blackout you can pause the car you know the thing if you want to read it but uh, I got them because they're little construction vehicles they're all little fire rescues you know like this guy cuts down the trees to keep the fire from moving now the you know nothing moves on these guys but I just thought they were cool because they were little vehicles so there's blackout and then I got the bigger you know there's two the these two are bigger this one's avalanche and you know it's a bobcat uh, pusher and this one you know says he pushes debris to keep fires from um, you know from uh, spreading so there's the back of that one avalanche and, you know he's a big boy the two biggest ones in this set that i found you know because there's limited planes that come with them too but the two biggest cars are this avalanche and then this last one i'm going to show you that's pretty cool man you know like i don't have any disney construction you know i mean they got little wheels but uh, I think they're totally cool. You know what I mean? That, you know, like, 
have never seen and this thing's super heavy i don't know what it is i guess it's some kind of cat i guess it's metal on the top feels metal smells metal so but yeah there's avalanche <clears throat> and they're all numbered you know what i mean like they're all part of the fire squad you know or whatever for uh whatever this town the town that they were in prop wash junction i should know the name of that there's the last one mayday I don't care what you say, man. That thing's just cool. And, you know, the only other planes vehicle I got was the, you know, the gas truck that fuels up the planes. He, you know, you guys seen him in my video in there. And this one's called Mayday. So, uh, that is awesome, man, right there. Look at that. And it says, what's San Lador? Prop wash, junction, fire, crash, rescue. And look, they even got mud on it. See how it's dirty? Supposed to be all, he's supposed to be old and rusty because uh, oh, I forgot to show you the back. There's a little bit about Mayday if you want to pause it and read it. So that thing's pretty cool right there. Six wheel, not only that, it's a six wheeler. You know what I mean? Six wheelers are just cool in my book. You know what I mean? That's pretty cool right there. Got the little hose and look, it's got like the tank on the top. And what's this? I guess this is another like filler spout. That thing is super cool. Look at that. PJFD, hmm. Prop Wash Junction Fire Department. I get it. Look, little chains on there. Pretty detailed, man. Look, even though it's even dirty and rusty on the back. So I got these guys because they'll be awesome in my in my cars collection. You know what I mean, because it's technically still Disney cars. So that's what I got for you. I wanted to show you my Grateful Dead, and <clears throat> believe it or not, when I stopped hunting tonight. I didn't really find anything. Some leftover K case that uh, I had dug through. Didn't find any errors. Believe it or not, they were waxing the floor uh, right around the toys. And, you know, I went in there and started looking at them. And then, the, of course, the guy came out, hey, can you get out of there? I don't want to have to rewax the floor. You know, give me a hard time. Like, so, whatever. So I got kicked out of the toy aisle for trying to look at Hot Wheels, ironically enough. Seems like they're always waxing the floor, doing something goofy when I'm trying to just go through the pegs on my way home. So, but uh, that's all I got for you now, guys. You know, you know me. I'll always, as soon as I get something cool or find something uh, awesome, you know, I got to show it to you. So, um, with any luck, hopefully that'll be my thumbnail because that thing's pretty cool. So, talk to you all soon, guys. Uh, sorry for the um, impromptu video, but you, you know when I find something awesome or you know I wanted to show you that set people are gonna start getting that set so um, I've gotten a lot of cool comments off of Facebook and uh, Instagram, so That's all I got talk to you later. See it